As you breathe, someone is taking their last breath. As you eat, someone is going to bed with an empty stomach. Someone is longing for that leftover food you just trashed. Someone wishes they had clean water to drink, a roof over their head, and a place to call home. As you ignore that call from your mom or dad, someone wishes their parents were still alive. They'd give just anything to have one moment with them. Some people don't even know whom their birth parents are, and have been on a quest searching for them their entire lives. As you complain about your kids and ignore your parental duties, as you compare your children to someone else's, as you abuse your own children both physically and verbally, just because of something they did, as you think about going to that clinic to abort that unborn child, I want you to know that someone wishes they could have one. They'd give anything to hear the cry of their own child, and they've been spending thousands of dollars trying to conceive, but to no avail. I know life is hard, and no one is immune from problems. No matter how much you've got, you will always lack something. You will always have something to complain about, because human wants are unlimited. But our needs are basic. You don't really need much to be happy. You are unhappy not because of what you don't have. You are unhappy because you are ungrateful for what you've got, and you are in constant pursuit for something new. We always want the latest phone, the latest car. The latest clothes and bags, and all for what? To look good and feel important? To get a few compliments from people? Can't you look good with the clothes you've got? There are new clothes on the market each and every day. There's a new iPhone and a new Samsung literally every year. So are you gonna keep spending lots of cash whenever there is something new on the market? These material things will never fulfill you. They can never fill the void and emptiness inside of you. I see people with a lot of clothes and bags. I see if they've got a mini boutique in their homes, but they always complain they have nothing to wear, and always want to go on a shopping spree. You wonder why they are always broke? They live way above their means just to create a facade. Their bank accounts are always in the red, and they are always borrowing from people just to keep up appearances. Stop comparing yourself to others. This life is not a race. Be content with what you have, and God will definitely bless you with more. I'd like you to spend a little time to count your blessings, name them one by one, and you'll realize you've got more than you think. As long as you breathe, as long as your heart beat, you gotta be grateful, because what you've got now is something you prayed about in the past, and someone is praying for the same thing right now. So when you go on your knees to pray. I want you to stop going with a to-do list for God, because God is not your personal assistant, neither is He your servant. He is not a means to an end, but He is Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. So thank God for everything. Thank Him for the food on your table. Thank Him for the air you breathe. Thank Him for each step you take. Thank Him for the eyes to see and the ears to hear. Thank Him when things are going good and when things are bad. Be thankful no matter what. And you will never lack. If you like this video, please share it with your friends.